So we're back with more I Am Jesus Christ prologue, and in this part two, we'll be finishing the prologue or demo of the I Am Jesus Christ game. In the previous episode, we fought Satan in the desert, and now uh, Satan is a bit angry. So if you thought that was crazy, hang on to the end of the video because we'll be even fighting viruses. So let's see what happens. I will go into every city, into every corner of them. I will take my power and spread my darkness everywhere. To all homes, to every human, every soul. I will enter their bodies and put my diseases inside. I will boil their minds and put my demon servants inside them. And then, I will go to Jerusalem, to their capital, and will tempt all citizens with my darkness and sins. In such a way, they will stop Jesus and kill him. Ha 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 ha! He can't stop me. Okay, the voice acting was good up to that point. <laughs> that that evil laugh from Satan was not it was not good. <laughs> I actually suggest not being so direct, like, oh we're gonna kill Jesus. No, I, I say we will we will finish the Son of God or something like that. I think it sounds more epic and cut off the the um the the, the cartoon villain laugh, I guess. I think that would be better. As Jesus walked beside the Sea of Galilee, he saw Simon and his brother Andrew casting a net fish. Come, follow me, Jesus said, and I will send you out to fish for people. The journey now continues. Satan. He, has he has spread, spread his sins, sins and dark energy throughout the land. You must enter into these dark areas and destroy his dark forces in order to proceed. Destroy the dark gems and pray in order to proceed. Dark gems. Alright, got it. Be banished, dark gem. There it goes. Oh yeah. Feels good to actually destroy dark gems. Oh, I've got like uh, holy hands and my my uh, my physical hand, or what is that? Yeah, <laughs> I don't know what that is. Yeah, I guess I guess yeah. I don't know. There we go. All four gems. You can claim territory as well as locate your next objective by using Z. Ooh. Yeah, we purified this. Magdala. Oh, we got a map now. We're at Magdala. And our objective is to help the fishermen. Okay, this, uh, the game is actually opening up very nicely. As you continue to progress in your journey, you'll claim more areas as you did earlier. Dark areas in the map will begin to be filled in properly and you'll be able to view new areas. Uh, truth be told, the map is a bit cumbersome to navigate like it's very slow to go up and down but okay oh a prayer area okay what can we do here unlocking new abilities you can unlock new abilities in this spiritual dimension approach the pressure plate in front of you to continue okay so prayer areas are like to unlock abilities that's great Ooh. I just go to the Okay, it appears it appears the pressure plate requires something to be placed on it. Press the Q in order to spawn an object to weigh it down. Oh I can spawn cubes. Okay. Uh, okay, wait, there we go. There we go. Fully pressed. Um Okay, now we can climb up the stairs. Uh, holding item. You can hold physics item by pressing right mouse button. 
Pressing to hold the item and then releasing to release, grab the gold bar and use it as a bridge. Okay. Okay, this has uh, Breath of the Wild vibes now, by using the physics items. Okay, I'm gonna have to use the, 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 the mouse scroll to pull the item back and now put it on top and uh, make a bridge. Oh my god, I love that. I love it. It's got physic puzzles. Okay, so uh, we just gained the skill of of spawning cubes and uh, and uh, yeah, I guess uh, moving stuff. Take talk to the fisherman on the dock. Okay, that's where we're going. Yeah, I mean, up to this point, you would say, okay, if 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 somebody came and told you you have to make a video game about the life of Jesus Christ, um. I think these guys are nailing it because um, you, I mean, to present it as a video game, it has to be entertaining as well. It has to be, it has to have some gameplay elements, and they're coming up with really good ideas. Do not worry. Don't worry about your life and what you will eat or drink, and don't worry about your body. And I think normally are. people would have Isn't trouble, like saying, "Okay, if I have to make a Jesus Christ game, more important um, how do I do it?" Like, clothes? you know, Look without it being boring. And I think that's that's a concept that many people have about biblical stories in general. But they're actually pretty epic if you read into them. Successfully move three groups of fish towards the boat. Okay. Press the tab button, select the interaction ability to test it. Okay. Okay, so we got this wheel with our powers that we'll be unlocking. Oh, heal. But interaction is the one that we're going to use now. Okay, so I'm going to have to... Um, you can guide fish by first holding the left click for five seconds and then holding the right click for five seconds. Fishies! Come over here, fishies! Okay, that's how you do it. Okay, fishies. Come over here. Come on, get to the boat. Get to the boat! There we go. Alright, talk to Peter. Now you see exactly how I can make you fishers of men. This mission shall be far more important than the fishing of fish. Your power is amazing. I shall follow you, Lord, since I have seen your miraculous power. Obviously, if somebody comes and can conduct fish just by using their hands like that, I, I would also follow them, you know? Right, so Jesus said to the servants, fill the jars with water. Okay, here we go. Waters, uh, turn water into wine time. Here we go. There's some dark gems here. I don't want any dark gems around my people. Get this stuff out of here. Get this stuff out of here. Be gone, dark gems. Okay, we claim this territory for us. Kana. In fact, uh, there it is on the map. Head towards the prey location. Okay, let's learn a new skill, I guess. You can launch boxes and hit targets by grabbing an object using right mouse and then pressing left without releasing. Spawn a box using Q in the ground. All right, let's uh, let's launch it, I guess. Oh yeah, look, I can push stuff like like Fushradar style. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Ugh. All right, I need to aim a bit better. Yeah, there we go. Gotcha. Okay, target practice for Jesus. Here we go. I'm getting better at, 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 at like launching cubes, holy cubes. Yeah, I locked a new ability, healing. All right, let's talk to uh, Simone, Simon, which was this guy. It looks like the wedding is up ahead. All right. Indeed, it does. Yes, it does look like it. Let us make haste. I would like to see my mother, and I am sure the bride and groom would appreciate our presence. All right, boys, let's sprint. Sprint with your boy Jesus. Come on, run. You gotta run. You're young, like me. An athletic. Let's go. 
If you do not judge other people, then you will not be judged. If you do not find others guilty, then you will not be found guilty. Forgive, and you will be forgiven. Give, and it will be given to you. That's a beautiful quote. All right, uh, there's Mama. Hello, Jesus. I haven't seen you in so long. I'm glad you could make it. I, I'm afraid the wedding appears to have a small issue. Is that a Greek amphora? Have they got back there? What is the issue? There's a man who appears to be in need of assistance. I'm not sure what to do. My time has not yet come. I don't know, but I thought you might be able to help. Let me see this man. Yeah, don't mind us, boys. Oh, you need help? What seems to be the matter? Oh, hello. I'm afraid we're in a bit of a bind. The people setting up and the people early to the party enjoyed the wine a bit too much. We've run out of wine and the party's about to start. The groom and bride will be very disappointed and I'll be in big trouble for this. All right, tell you what, move the judge to the stage. I don't, I don't quite understand. Quite understand but okay. I guess I have no choice. I hope you can find wine somewhere. Come talk to me again if you manage to solve the problem. <laughs> don't worry, I'll take care of it. Okay, entering Holy Spirit mode. You can enter Holy Spirit mode by pressing tab and then selecting the object interaction power. Object interaction. Okay, turn each of the water jars into wine. All right, here we go. All right, people, witness this. Yeah, it's a nice wine. Do as I say and go and taste the water. The water. <laughs> I don't understand what this has to do with anything, but I'll do what you say. Yeah, you, you just do that. Do that. Yeah. Say, what does my wine taste like? This is wine. How did you do this? <laughs> like I said, I'll take care of it. This wine is better than the wine we had before. Thank you, thank you. You saved the day. We must go tell the groom. He must taste this wine. Fantastic. All right, uh, what else is there to do, my man? I'll knock on the door. I know he's inside getting ready still. All right. Hello. Jesus, I want you to meet the groom. He's getting ready for the wedding. Okay. Hello. I'm glad you could make it. I'm a bit embarrassed though. I have gotten word that we have run out of wine. Okay, here we can see a stark difference in voice acting quality. But oh, it's okay, I guess. Do not worry, my friend. I have taken care of it. Jesus managed to get us wine. Let's go and try it. It's the best wine I've ever had. Well, I'll be the judge of that. Let's go try it. Oh yeah, the, the there's a very big difference from this voice actor to the other one. Also in microphone quality and recording conditions. Okay. This one is amazing. What did you do to make it so good? I took care of it. <laughs> Jesus is very charismatic. He just says, I'll take care of it. Now we've got chapter 6. Your son will live. I can't really read it because it's got this in front. I, yeah, your son will live. Alright, let's go. Chapter 6 of I Am Jesus Christ Prologue. Once more he visited Cana in Galilee, where he had turned the water into wine. And there was a certain royal official whose son lay sick at Capernaum. When this man heard that Jesus had arrived in Galilee from Judea, he went to him 
and begged him to come and heal his son who was close to death. Unless you people see signs and wonders, Jesus told him, you will never believe. The royal officials said, Sir, come down before my child dies. Go, Jesus replied, your son will live. The man took Jesus at his word and departed. Okay, so we're gonna have to heal the the, the guy's son. Speak with Peter. Teacher, this uh, Roman official would like to speak with you. It seems like he has a request. Word of you has been getting around the area. Okay, this one also is recording in a very different um, environment than the other voice actors. Because the quality is just much lower than the than the other ones. Okay then, let me go and see him. Let's speak with the Roman official. Hello, man. Lord, I cower before you. My only son is dying and I beg you to heal him. I know I am unworthy to have such a request, but I know anything is possible. And I believe that you can heal him. Ah, you will not believe. Unless you see signs and wonders, you will not. Okay, so uh, let's let's uh, yeah, we can heal people. Okay, let's go with the healing ability. Ooh, clearing viruses. You can clear viruses by pressing left mouse button in front of the viruses inside of the body. Okay. Oh wow, we're we're in a vein or an artery or something. Ah, oh, we can see uh, red red blood cells. Okay, we we have to navigate through this boy's arteries. What is that? COVID? That is <laughs> that's like COVID. Oh my god! Let's let's heal that sucker. Get it out of here. Get away. Be banished. Be banished, COVID. If only we had Jesus to, to, to clean the pandemic when it happened. Oh, God. Be banished. You can fully heal the body by pressing left mouse as well as right mouse at the same time. All right. Let's, let's do a super heal. That is remote healing, right there. Okay, you didn't see what I just did, but I'm gonna tell you. Return to your son. Go and return to your son, for he has been healed. I'll go, Lord. I believe that you have healed my son. It is not your faith that healed your son, because you lack it. You had a doubting heart, however. I have come to save those who do not yet believe, and fish for them, and teach them to believe in me. Blessed are those who do not see, yet still believe. I know now that you have seen, you will believe, and will be saved. Thank you. I will tell everyone about you. Return and believe. Okay, that, that was cool. Yes, Lord. He is now a believer. Did you see how he spoke? Yes, I saw it, Lord. The centurion. He was so urgent. Despite him being a high-ranking official, the man's faith was weak, but is now strong. Yes, did you hear what he said? He said, I will tell everyone about you. Peter, this man is now my voice, my hand, my eyes. He will spread the word to everyone, and many will come to me. Peter. Do you see now what I was talking about? It is just the beginning. Many will come to me, and many will be healed, and many will see. It is just the beginning. Yes, Lord, I see it now. Likewise, I will spread the word, and help you reach everyone. Many will also come to you, and many will be healed, and many will see. Nice. Nice. Um, 
Jesus Christ, the, the first influencer in history. While he was still on the way, his servants met him with the news that his boy was living. When he inquired as to the time when his son got better, they said to him, Yesterday, at one in the afternoon, the fever left him. Then the father realized that this was the exact time at which Jesus had said to him, Your son will live. So he and his whole household believed. This was the second sign Jesus performed after coming from Judea to Galilee. And that is it. That is the prologue. Thank you for playing this game, and we're looking forward for your feedback. Yeah, I'll, I'll certainly give my feedback. In fact, I'll share this video with the developers uh, as soon as I can so they can check my reactions and uh, check what I did. Uh, especially because I, I did share some, some some concerns and some stuff. But overall, my impressions are um, it's cool. It's original. It's nice. It's nothing groundbreaking. It's not... It's not you know, the best game ever, or it's gonna be, you know, something amazing. But it is original, and, uh, you know, the theme, the religious theme that it has, with the background of Jesus and everything, uh, I think this is, this is a good way of actually retelling that story in video game form. In a decent way. So, even though there's lots of, um, from what I gathered from this prologue, from this demo, uh, a lot of the gameplay parts are very gimmicky. I thought it was going to be open world when they talked about the map, but it seems it's all instance-based, um, so you really can't travel around. Uh, maybe I'm mistaken, maybe in the full game it is, uh, but from what I've seen in this demo, it's very railroaded, very guided. Um, for, uh, for advanced gamers, people who have been playing for a long time, um, they'll see through those gimmicks, just like I did. Uh, but still, it was fun. I liked it. And as a storytelling experience, I think it's really cool. The artistic um, point of view, it's really nice to look at. I really like the environments that they created. And, um, and yeah, and for people who want to maybe learn about Jesus in a more entertaining way... Um, this is a great, this is a great thing. It's good. It's good stuff. It's good stuff. Um, so, so yeah, is it, is it an amazing game? No, no, I wouldn't say so. But it is a, a nice curiosity and it's decently, decently made. Obviously there's bugs, performance needs some addressing. But after that, I'm looking forward to the full release. And uh, I already got it on my wish list. And uh, hopefully when it comes out, I'll be able to play the whole thing and uh, and uh, and see if they improved some of these aspects. Bye bye.